Intro. Have you ever looked at a map and wondered why the countries are shaped the way they are? Believe it or not, the lines drawn on maps have not always been static. From the conquests of empires to the declarations of independence, war has often been the architect of our world's geography. Today, we're diving into five that completely redesigned the world map. Understanding these conflicts gives us insight into the current political climate and how history is quite literally drawn by conflicts. Join us as we explore these fascinating transformations. Main content. Let's start with the Great War, known to many as World War I. Before World War I, empires dominated Europe with land stretched over various continents. The Austro-Hungarian Empire, for instance, covered what is now Austria, Hungary, Czech Republic, Slovakia, and parts of many other countries. Following the war, it was dissolved, leading to the creation of several independent countries. The same happened with the Ottoman Empire, which was split into states that later became parts of modern-day Turkey, Iraq, Syria, and others. Maps were redrawn, and new nations were born out of the wreckage of empires. Moving on to World War II, which further sculpted modern-day Europe and Asia. Post-1945, German territories were divided, giving shape to East and West Germany, eventually reunited in 1990. In Asia, Japan relinquished control over Korea, leading to the split of North and South Korea, lines that are heavily fortified to this day. Talk about a dramatic redraw. World War II also prompted the reorganization of borders in Eastern Europe and the establishment of the United Nations, aimed at preventing further global conflicts. Next, the partition of India in 1947. This not only marked the division between India and Pakistan, but also set a precedent for creating new borders based on religious demographics. The partition led to large-scale migrations and a reshaping of societies, along with a legacy of tension between the two nations. Imagine the upheaval of moving millions based on newly drawn borders. Let's not forget the African decolonization of the 1950s and 1960s. As European colonial powers withdrew, new nations were declared across the continent. The rapid decolonization led to the formation of countries such as Nigeria, Ghana, Kenya, and Algeria. Each new nation added a unique shape to the global map representing independence and the end of colonial rule. Lastly, the dissolution of the Soviet Union in 1991. This was a geopolitical earthquake, leading to the independence of 15 countries, including Russia, Ukraine, and the Baltic states. Suddenly, the maps had more nations, marking a significant end to the Cold War era. This changed not only maps, but also political alliances and economic structures around the world. Outro. We've seen how history is shaped by conflicts, each war redrawing lines and deciding fates. From the fall of age-old empires to the rise of new independent states, wars have a profound impact on the global map. What did you think of these transforming events? Did any wars impact on the map surprise you? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you found this exploration as intriguing as we did. Until next time, keep pondering the past to understand the present.